Now, weather and your hour-by-hour -hour forecast with meteorologist Brad Sugden. Hey everyone, we are tracking a little bit of fog out there once again to start. In fact, much of the area is seeing some foggy conditions, but as we go throughout our Sunday, should burn off a little easier than it burned off on our Saturday as well. But let's put this into motion for you hour by hour so you can plan your day. Check this out. By noontime, we're seeing eh, maybe partly cloudy skies left as some of that fog is still trying to burn off. But by the afternoon, a lot of sunshine. That means temperatures will climb into the lower 80s for many of us, maybe middle 80s back off to the west where we see the most sunshine throughout the day. Otherwise, not that bad of a Sunday. Temperatures pretty in check for this time of year. Not that bad at all tonight. We'll see temperatures falling down through the 60s and eventually by our Monday morning, actually look at this, develop more fog which could slow down our morning commute just a little bit more. So by Monday morning, give yourself a little extra time to get to work, school, because it's going to be just a little more uh, on the foggy side once again. But like I said, by the afternoon, that burns off. Check this out. There's all that fog, and then there it goes. Maybe a few clouds throughout the day, so we'll have to keep an eye on that 87 degrees. Those clouds on top of the fog could keep us down a little cooler than that. But we'll be tracking that for you as we get throughout the day. 91, though, on Tuesday. Not expecting too much in the way of fog that morning, but late in the day. We're talking the possibility for maybe a few afternoon showers and thunderstorms. Those last only until early Wednesday. And then after that, check this out. Lower 90s head our way. Very humid conditions right through the week into next weekend.